Genetic engineering is the process to alter the structure and nature of genes using techniques like molecular cloning and transformation. In other words, it is the process of adding or modifying DNA in an organism to bring about a great deal of transformation. Genetically altered embryos are artificially selected, which can be achieved by introducing the desired genetic material into the embryo itself or into the sperm and or egg cells of the parents, either by delivering the desired genes directly into the cell or by using gene editing technology. Genetic engineering has been feared that soon we are interfering with nature, trying to play God and cheat him out of his chance to decide whether we are blonde or dark haired, whether we have blue or green eyes, or even how intelligent we are. The concerns that some may have regarding such an intriguing part of science are still alive and well, although they are less talked about nowadays than they were those few years ago. There are a number of benefits that are achievable through genetic engineering. Increasing life expectancy is one of those. By editing out an unborn baby's defective genes and only retaining the healthy genes, the baby will grow up healthier. Therefore, you may increase their overall life expectancy by up to 30 years. When you use genetic modification technology to create a designer baby, it also eliminates the chances of various diseases such as cystic fibrosis, muscular dystrophy, sickle cell anemia and down syndrome not only with genetic engineering can you modify their hair and eye color but the fact that you can give your child a higher iq high intelligence is fundamental to the human capital that drives societies in the information age cons of genetic engineering some people believe that genetic engineering is a natural process and that designing babies is too much like playing God. Some believe that allowing genetic engineering will create gaps in society due to the favoring of certain phenotypes such as height or skin color. Genetic engineering is not error-proof and may lead to death of the unborn or also form new illnesses due to accidental editing of genes. Complications of pre-implantation genetic diagnosis include ovarian hyperstimulation syndrome and potential harm to the embryo during biopsy. Ethical Dilemma Where do we draw the line? Is it ethical to experiment on embryos? The United States has taken an intermediate stance on human gene editing while other countries such as China and Mexico have made permissive laws. Lastly, we have to ask ourselves, will we be using this for superficial purposes or for therapeutical means?